girl, you can't be fed up. No girls on the left and no right. Uh, no what is up, guys? Son of Beast here, and we are back with another NBA playoffs. This time, the matchup is here as the Boston Celtics take on against the Milwaukee Bucks between Jason Tatum and Giannis Antetokounmpo. Right now, Team Giannis is in the lead right now with amazing points so far, and he is also called the Greek Freak. That's right, folks, the Greek Freak. That's what I just definitely did notice, how he plays really well and how hard he works. Unbelievable. With all my thoughts on my exam, this is what I just realized about Giannis Antetokounmpo. He's strong. And he is powerful since drafted in NBA 20, 2013. As I, and I mentioned it before, that's because of how I just remember it so far. And by that time, this is going to be amazing to check out what the game is up to. But in that case, I'm going to get ready to get things off. And see what we have here so far. We got, I have so, we got so many bucks, uh, uniform that we're looking at. But in that case, I'm just going to have to go with this, uh, amazing statement. Black and green. Here are the starting lineups between the Celtics and the Bucks. Kemba Walker, Jalen Brown, Gordon Hayward, Jason Tatum, and Daniel Fies. And on the other hand, we have this Eric Bledsoe. Wesley Matthews, Chris Middleton, the Greek Freak, Giannis Antetokounmpo, and Brooke Lopez. So first, first things off, I'm going to be playing as uh, Milwaukee Bucks. Yep, that is right because uh, Celtics doesn't have any other, other good, good uh, players. They don't have Kyrie Irving. They don't have Terry Rozier, and of course, they do not have. One of the best time player that was here before, and they definitely we never uh, got anything to show you back again. Al Horford. So right now, with that being said, the rest of the lineups are on the board, and we are taking a look at one of each uh, players that you never got a chance to see: Marcus Smart, Ennis Cantor, Brian Wanamaker, Roy Williams, and G Williams, and there'll be more on the bottom. Right there, we got DiVincenzo, Eric L.A. Sofa, George Hill, Paul Kanatin, Robin Lopez, McWilliams, Kyle Corfer, and S.S. Brown. So, looks like I do not see Paiu Gasol anyway, because um, he might not be playing anymore, but his brother is, might, is still playing. Anyways, let's get the game on the playoffs. The Bucks are always hyped to play in front of their home crowd. And tonight's no different. Some confident players coming through the tunnel earlier on. And the game arrival sponsored by Express. Dress like a pro. Pfizer Forum bringing a lot of players back into the ninth game, and they are on the roll, taking a ready a good look for game one. And yes, this is their statement of the court that you guys would never believe this one is on right here. Kemba Walker, he has 21 points, point two, and steals only 0 0.9, but that was not quite enough as we were looking to see if he had the best one. And a Greek freak has 29.6 points, assist has 5.8 assists. That is craziness, how you can get talk about it. Brooke Lopez, here is a points a game, 20.6, that was 2016 through 17, his most career ever that he would been playing here so far, but this year, only 12.5 had made the points at that time. Not enough to get there, but it's all happening. Let's hear what David Aldridge had to say. Any news? Well, the maturity and poise of a young Jason Tatum has often been talked about. Maybe that's because his parents prepared him for the NBA from an early age in St. Louis. They had pretend press conferences using a hairbrush as the microphone. And you can say he's been groomed for this. And it's paying off, guys. Yeah, yeah thank you. We did notice about Dave Jason Data. He knows everything about it all. Here are the lineups once again, and the key matchup 
is Jason Tatum and Giannis Antetokounmpo are the key matchups for tonight's game in Game 1. And they're definitely putting up the show that time. I guess we're going to be taking a look and see what they have here. Brad Stevens is the head coach for the uh, Boston Celtics. He wasn't here a while of time well, by his seventh career with the Boston. He's doing really nice, uh, making some stuff for money, helping the coaches, but the players play and spectators be positive. And the Boston Celtics wins the tip-off that time, and we are underway in Milwaukee. Yes, and we got a steal for Black. So here comes the Greek freak. Oh, yeah, that good start for Giannis Antetokounmpo. And he has his first two to start things off. Here's Walker against Bledsoe with the cover. He bishes off to Brown. Walker for taking the two. Antetokounmpo with the rebound. Milwaukee on the other hand. Here's Antetokounmpo. Passes to Bledsoe for three. Good, and a shot is right in the point. And that's his first assist for Antetokounmpo. Walker passes Tatum to Fies. Fies to Brown. Screen on Matthews, avoided it away. And it's another miss for Boston. I mean, Boston. Knocking it over. Here's Bledsoe. Makes the three. This is by Andre DeCumpo, his second time. And now here's Walker. Only no, only no gain of points made. Taysom coming in the other way. Finds him. Oh, blocked by the Greek freak. What a, how amazing do you feel? What is the effect on the team if it goes seven? Lopez to Middleton. I wish they did it. I don't like the Middleton to, to Lopez. And over the course of NBA Shot, no good. They walk around any other direction. Here, here's, uh, here's Fives. The foul goes on Lopez's first personal foul. <laughs> yeah, that was a little bit dirty that time, then that was quite well. That was not right, and it's not, took a, not, not a good start here for the Milwaukee Bucks. Daniel Fice going to shoot two. Come on, Bucks fans, make some noise. So the first one cannot make it in. And Burke Lopez, he's got his brother here too. Well, I think it's Robin Lopez. I think they might be brothers by by each two name, same last name, uh, but different uh, different first names. That's black and orange. That represents the Harley Davidson color. And and they would know, they would appeal to be nice and showing you the Harley Harley Harley, Harley Motor Davidson. That's what I wanted forever, yeah. Harley Davidson's motorcycle in the museum. You guys would have to be figure, but we want to go here too. Matthews for three. You have to have rebounded by Lopez. Like Shots good and uses the backboard to, to connect. Walker in the other way. Here's Bledsoe. Covered by uh, Walker. Passes to Hayward for three. There's a triple. And there's only one assist that puts him up. Walker has his first assist. Andre Kupo passes to Milton. And here's Matthews. Matthews, Matthews to Dodge to Kumpo. And it's stolen by Tatum. Here comes the fast break. And the shot's good for Hayward. Middleton has his first foul of the game. From Tatum that time. So the defense had overcommitted. 
and then made them pay with the sweet dive. Well done. Austin shooting that third free throw attempt of the game. Here's the second free throw, and now uh, Gordon Hayward will be shooting the line for one. Shot and it goes in. Hayward is an exciting Boston trailing by three. Who can really, really score? Here's Andre Decumpo. You know, you look at the awards given out by the league. Hold the ball. A good saver. Low pass to Matthews. Touchdown in terms of high performance. Off it again. Missed again. Brown with a rebound. There should be a playoff MVP. I made this case in my book. That's a great the, re the layup won't go in. And I would like to see now here's Lopez in the other direction. 325 remaining with 10 to 3. 10 to 7. I'm sorry. Trail by 3. Have all the backstory of who it should Passes to Lopez. And there's a foul called on Tatum. His first foul. Now Brooke Lopez will take 2-2 two, two at the line for free throw. They're good at pointing. They're good at fist pumping. First guy during the timeout running over. Just bumps. They have handshakes. Oh, yeah. uh, they're waiting at the scores table before the game to do the special handshake with each guy. I feel like that guy deserves some shine. Uh, last year, DeAndre Jordan, I think, was one of the first guys. I first one falls for it. Now uh, the substitution for the, for the Boston. Was like, man, this guy's really easy. All four come out. Brown to switch over to the small forward. out there now for the Bucks. Let's go uh, back. Matthews Mills in sub out. Hill, DiVincenzo, and Panate come in. And George Hills subbed in for Eric Nelson. Two free throws made it in so far for Brook Lopez, and he has four. Now here's Wanamaker, and it's covered by Hill. Great pass! And there's a layup that puts up another pointage on the board. The Clippers did the last couple years when Fear the deer. Here's Hill. And instead of just being DiVincenzo being darn close but not quite they Ange de Kumpo like running in tried to figure out how to create caps the layup and it goes in the fear deer the Greek free and they stumbled naming the fear of deer the king of the of the box just knocking it off the course that's the approach I would use. I, I would never... I mean, contested, but great D for Anshtakumpo. And Lopez gets another rebound. Bounce pass to DiVincenzo. He finds the Kanatin. Kanatin right over to, uh, to DiVincenzo. The shot won't go in for DiVincenzo. Here's another one, blocked by Anjikupo. Under two minutes, here's Anjikupo. Woo! That guy, when that block comes up, it all comes down to this. The dunk knows it all. The Greek freak. We also call him the fear of the... the the Buck King, the King of the Buck. Timeout called by Boston. Their first timeout with 1.45 remaining. How would you know if Gianch de Kumpo had it again? He would be surprised all alone. It's going to manifest itself. And now the substitutions are right, right on the board. Here we got some changes, and here's Williams subbed out, subbed in for Jason Tatum. Now here's Cantor, Wanamaker for three. Rebounded by DiVincenzo with a miss. Now onto DeCumpo is switched off into the center. And Eli Sofa on point forward. And don't step into that landing space when he comes down from shooting. He passes back to Kanate. One layup made in, and another hand went by. That was a pass by Kanate, a first assistant of this game. Load management is interesting. Load management is the worst. Here's Wanamaker, pass to Cantor. Passes, an incomplete shot. Yeah. Yeah, so far in the other direction, George Hill with a move, 
Great move, Technique, and George got it. George Hill got his first bucket of the game. Very good start offensively as a result. Smart passes to Kim. The kick out to Williams. Here's Williams. Boston. Boston with another miss. 36 left to play in the first quarter. Now passes to Hill. He goes right to DiVincenzo. A move! Oh, a tight one, but there would have been a foul. He's Brown against Hill. 16 seconds left. Right again! Great freak with the block! And that's where you know that's the name of the Greek freak person that blocks it and no foul call. Oh, Lily Sofa made that buzz beater. How incredible do you think? Look at that. He's knocking down so far. They are putting the points up with 22 to 9. That is the end of the first quarter. Second quarter is underway, and you're watching it on NBA 2K Sports. Our relationship started when I was in high school. He came to my morning workouts and uh, really recruited me at Butler and was kind of the first guy that I think believed in me that I could make it to the next level. And I'm, sure Greg I'm sure that uh, that Gordon Hayward always knows uh, Coach Brad Stevens when he first met in college that time back in a year long before. But for this time, he's now he's now here and trying to give it his best shot to find out what his next coach will be. So Kyle Corfer was trying to go for her attack, but Williams has it foul. Here's Kyle Corfer one more time. And here it is. That's where the block was at. Reject his hands and went down forward. So that's the first one that you just did not see how Kyle Corfer did. And he wasn't playing with the Utah Jazz. And that's, that's, why, that's why I seem to forget. Kyle Corfer going to shoot for two. And it's DiVincenzo in at the shooting guard. So that's who Milwaukee starts the second way. The first free throw goes in. And, be, and because you know that Kyle Corfer always does it better, he's been playing with, uh, with the Cleveland Cavaliers in a couple seasons before transferring into Utah Jazz and then finally heading up to Milwaukee Bucks. So that's his second time that he was here. And now Kyle Corfer has got it in. There's definitely being a Wanamaker to Brown. Brown up. Brown makes this free. Jalen Brown makes that makes that three. And that's what you did not see with the error player open way up front. Passes to Ilya Sofa. He goes right in. Robin Lopez with the screen and not a problem for Ilya Sofa. And the Bucks lead by 14. Bucks lead by 14, 26 to 12, with 6 10 remaining. The defense doesn't make their presence felt. Now here's Smart. Here's Smart coming off a 16. Coming off really hot. Looking in. Rebound. Smart takes the first point of the bucket. Show you what a fantastic all-around effort it was. Here's Hill on the ever which there on the ever way. Corfer in the corner. Well, Kevin, Chris Middleton was a first time All Star in 2019. Hey, Robin Lopez, he never got a chance to do one. Middleton is one of the league's best shooters. Here they sub it back to DiVincenzo. This game to a new system under coach Mike Budenholzer. The shot. Oh, he made that one in, and that's the three. Oh my goodness, and that's a, and also but that's a assist for Knotten. First time All Star in Wilders. First time made it through. The shot clock. Here's Wanamaker. Oh, blocked it by Ailey Sofa. And that's the first block of the game on defense. Right away, Williams takes his second personal foul. Stop the clock at 506. And to look at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Bucks. Boy, the three-point shot has really been dropping for him early on. 
Now, LA, really, so far, this game there, to try to work on the pro. So, at that time, here it is, taking two shots. He makes the first throw, first free throw. Now he some switches for the, for the Celtics. Walker, Hayward, Williams, and Fies checks in. Williams switched over to point guard. To point forward. And then four of each. And four players subbed in with, uh, from the box. Oh, Billy Sippel couldn't handle the second shot in. Here's a free throw in the couple season. And the straightaway for Marcus Smart pulls it in. And of course, this is Smart's biggest hurdle. Sometimes he looks great. But so, but so, it's just the opposite. But so, passes to Middleton. Here's how Middleton can do. What he, what does he have to do? Here's Billy Sofa, and the foul puts up on Fies. His first foul. And that's his uh, 15th foul for the Celtics. Stop the clock at 4.34 left. Billy Sofa will try it again. He makes the first throw, and now Tatum is sucked in for Williams. Jason Tatum, he's checked in for Robert Williams. And Wesley Matthews is checked in for Corfer. Only one shot, and he does. Fixed it right in time. You're smart. Five points now smart. Five points made in so far by making this attempt. Here in the second quarter, we play knocking him out of here. But here's Hayward. Hayward, Hayward misses the three and couldn't make that shot back. Let's really right in the uh, in the inside of the paint. He passes to Middleton. Paper element to it. Pretty holding it. Good recover. Let's go right around Middleton. Here's Ellis Sofa, and there's the double, double points. Assist by Middleton. Seven points in the quarter. Stopping again. Walker made that three. Three point range. And doing a much better job. And that's what you notice. They they played against Milwaukee this season with two games at Milwaukee. Bledsoe now passes up to Matthews. He passes back to Milton. Not the steal. Almost almost had it, but it didn't go in. Walker again. Matthews with the rebound. He at least so far could have had, could have had that time. 17 points was their biggest margin. No screen protected. Ooh, great pass. Great layup. And Elias Sofa's got another one. He has 11. Field goal range. 68. 33. Ah, Hayward had it again. Made the three. Third three pointer in a row. Adjustment time for these guys. The defense. Bledsoe in the other direction. Now here's Bledsoe. Bledsoe passes to Middleton. a scheme averaging around 15 and a half points a game. I'm going to need to fix this. Middleton against Walker. And he passes right over to Bledsoe. Three seconds to shoot. Williams. Close one. Not making that. Not making the shot in time. You're smart. And smart. Score the basket. Score the basket with a layup and a drive. Marcus Smart got seven. Only three out of five fragment and two assists. The box, it was a loss to the Celtics. Plexo finds Ellie Sofa. Two minutes in the second period. Here is Bledsoe. Bledsoe misses. 
You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space. Hayward. Pass to Walker. And another, and another miss for Boston. Ile Silva to Williams. Williams passes to Matthews. Matthews to Williams. Tough move, but didn't make it. But great D for Tatum. Bill Simmons, always a compelling discussion. And another miss for Hayward. He missed it a second time. 110 left to play. always give you a great point of view. And you know what? I think he needs his own. Rebound again. Pass to Williams. Find an open man recover. Bledsoe. Ilya Sofa. Here's Ilya Sofa. Following the miss by Wesley Matthews. Here's Williams up again, and there's the tap. Made that one in. And it's six foot nine now. Williams Walker in the other way. Inside, so you got to keep him out of the paint. Only, only a triple that time, but not even enough. Under shot. Under shot. And we got a block and rejection. I think that's Ellie Sofa that I'm looking at. Oh, Williams would have had it out, the ball, but Tatum took it away. Walker finding another way. Blocked by Bledsoe. Oh, there's a recover. And with, and with Feist, he makes that one in. Assisted by Walk Tatum. There we leading it by Milwaukee leading by 11. And, the and here's the pass to Matthews. And that's the first half. 38 to 27 is your score. And with seven points making it making the quarter for a better time. And now it's time to go Court Aldrich. Court side as David Aldrich stands by. Kevin, thanks. Coach, you guys have been able to limit their scoring. How have you done that? Well, I think our activity off the end of pick and rolls is making it uh, difficult on them, contesting every shot, uh, denying just our activity in general. High hands and quick feet. Thanks, Coach. Back to you, Kevin. Coach Budenholzer is the only uh, head coach from the Milwaukee Bucks, and we'll stick around after the halftime show. We've got a great story to tell you about a uh, whole thing, and this has been an exciting season all the way across the globe on, in, in the U.S., and now we are getting ready to set things up here in the second half, and Ilya Sufa made 11 points that time, uh, made the shot 11 points and two rebounds. Um, I'm not sure uh, which one it is that time, but I'm, I might be saying this is going to be a toughest, toughest game of the night, but uh, I always say Bucks are in first place. Here's Middleton, ready to ask the Kumbo. Nice move, and he's totally on fire. Superstar. He's still a superstar and he's already played part as Team Giannis. Mayward on the other hand. Achikupo with the rebound. So that's another rebound for Achikupo as he's got six. Knocking him out of here. Bledsoe on the other hand. Lost it by Brown. Hayward can't connect. Middleton in the other section. 20 rebounds for for the Bucks, but only 12 for the Boston Celtics. Here's Matthews covered by Lopez. And the Bledsoe made that shot. 32% for the Celtics, but only 62 percentage for the Bucks. And on the flip side, Greg, the defenders pass right through Hayward. Hayward misses again on a three-point range. Achikupo finds Bledsoe. And uh, we're about a minute and a half here into the second half. He passes right to Bledsoe. Trying to get open his open. open up and he connects it in. Bledsoe made that shot. 
Here in the other section right now, Walker against Bledsoe. Staff here now. I mean, their game plan has been perfect. Shots good. Walker for Walker made that shot. Count that in. They finally get one down. But they only have one down so far. Not a lot of them. Not a lot of people were mistaken again. So far here in the second half. To the middle, ten finds Bledsoe. Bledsoe makes that in. Timeout called by Boston. There's a second timeout. 4.50 is the time has stopped. They are going on the, on the fast break. Looking all over the teammates. Some changes for the Bucks and the Celtics. Now here for Chris Middleton and the other uh, players. They are, they are now switched up on the board. Here's Tatum. Tatum makes that three. Robert Williams comes in for Gordon. They're coming in really fast, but not a lot of people were saying that they wanted to keep it going. Anji Kupo finds Hill. Pass to DiVincenzo. Here's DiVincenzo. He's covered by Brown. DiVincenzo. Anji Kupo running in. And he makes the glass board to pull him up. Only 10 points allowed already. He made 10 points and 10 points in the paint. Here's Wanamaker. Here's Wanamaker right in the corner trying to stop on Greek Freak. Nice D, but recover. Williams kept connected the three like you know, Gordon Hayward did. One more reason why they're in control. Yeah, double digit advantage on the He passed off to Hill. They've taken the initiative. They've played, I think, with more personal. Hill's shot's good. That's a two. That's number two, and he has four. Celtics trail by 18. Celtics trailing by 18. He dishes right over to Williams. Roy. Roy Williams. That's what the name I was going to look at. Connected? No. Not, didn't have that chance again. DiVincenzo turns the other way. He passes the hill. He passes up to DiVincenzo. Anchikumpo makes another point and has 12. That was the pass and assist by DiVincenzo. And that's what you didn't expect to see, that pass and assist. Want to make her for Brown? Brown missed again. Kanaten going the other way. Kanaten trying to stop the move. Lopez in the other way. Uh, in the other way. Over on to the Kumpo. And that's another assist by Lopez. Lopez has got his third assist. Lopez has his third assist. Rebounding well this summer. He passes Cantor. Kyrie Irving and Al Horford. Kimball Walker possibly a Brown going in. Brown misses the shot. Two minutes in the third quarter. Age 37. A revamped roster, but I think they remain a contender in the East. Now oh, here's Young. Trying to look for the handoff. The pass to Connaughton. Pass to Connaughton. Not Connaughton. No, he passes up. Lopez. Close one. Ivan Kumbo kicks to Lopez. He didn't want to take his time to shoot it again, but here's, here's Connaughton. The Lopez. Pass it out to Kumpo. He sinks it in. Another point goes in. 14 to 16. An assist by Lopez. It's fourth time. Boston calls time. With 116 remaining. 56 to 32. They are they are on fire. Looking for another M MVP award to any player if they win the finals.
Some changes right now for the Bucks. And right now, here's uh, Brooke Lopez coming in. And out. And changes for the Celtics. Brown with the fadeaway jumper, and he made that one shot in. And bolts. Anthony Kupo in the other, in the other way. Mines Roplin, Robin Lopez. Here's DiVincenzo. Passes it to Panat Connaughton. Connaughton shot, good. Another bucket and assist by DiVincenzo. Points in the paint between the two teams. Yeah, it's really been quite a contrast. I like the way they're attacking the middle. There's a loose spot. Reach and foul called on DiVincenzo. DiVincenzo, his first. Jalen Brown and Cantor coming out. Hayward and Fies are on the court. Make it some changes. Walker. Roll over to Smart. And another one. Lopez trying to knock it away, but it looks like I think Giannis Antetokounmpo trying to take some, some time. Has been impressive. Guys, that's putting it. Robin Lopez and Kanata. Here's Connaughton. And there's a foul called on Williams. His first foul. Seven feet tall. Antetokounmpo. Jeez, Brad Stevens getting a little bit worried about what, what, he's, what he was going to say. And, but that's how his technical team foul is putting up too much rhythm on team foul. Must have work. Hunter DeCoupo shooting two. Ooh, close one. Unfortunately, he didn't get there that time. He didn't get there to 20 points yet. Only 10 rebounds and two assists that time. That's all I'm seeing. Continue to get better because of his work I'll see if he can take 17 points. That's why I need to know. Yep, he made it. Three points needed so far for Giannis Antetokounmpo for MVP. Hayward made that three. And that's the assist by Walker. Six seconds, five seconds. And that will do the third quarter. Giannis Antetokounmpo looking strong and fantastic. With 59, and the other team with a, with a crowd favorite to know the truth, to 37. Fourth quarter, underway after this. Here's Brad, here's Brad Stevens has to say. One thing we can't do is have empty possessions where we're shooting it before or we're turning it over before we can set our defense. Well, Brad Stevens is always putting up his best time of the career or most season. And and with that time, this is how we did notice a lot of bunch of people going out everywhere in that moment. Rebounded by Lopez, the number one. Pass out to Williams. Williams with a finish. And it's, and it's Lopez with a first assist. And so Here's Walker in the other way. Lines uh, to try to cover up Corford. Clark, you know, some players just don't need a lot of reach. They can play basketball all day, every day, and don't want to. Yeah, we got to reach a foul for Williams, Williams is first. Yeah, they do. 24 7 guys, we call them. They Corford is checked out. Wesley Matthews is checked in. Are out of fuel. Guys like. Um, Paul They're Jones definitely looking for uh, Wesley Matthews to start. Robin Williams with a block. Nice Steve. Pass to Will pass to Matthews. Now Middleton. Now it's Middleton. Six on the shot clock. Wesso with the with the move. 
and couldn't connect it again. It's, it's, it's still another miss. Smart in the other direction. Walker. Attitude. Because he takes a ton of pride. Ton of surprises flowing up so far. And here's the here's Bledsoe. Knocking in the other direction. Bledsoe to Matthews. Back to Bledsoe. Coming in. Over Smart. Another miss by Milwaukee. games in Mexico. One in England. It's nice to see. Yeah, it really is because. All you? Oh, that was success. I don't know. I don't know what control do you use for for an alley oop, but it's really. It's really kind of that hard. Bledsoe well, now this is off to Matthews. It's an additional level of travel, no doubt. About a week to ten days. Here's Bledsoe rolling out. In, make it. Count the basket. Bledsoe's got 14 form points. Around the other end is Walker. We can move. Tight squeeze, and there's a good D for Milwaukee. He is so strong in the paint. Screen on Williams. Williams against Bloodsoe. Dishes a dish off to Williams. Pass over to Matthews. Goes to the goes with a round or wrap around, and Matthews done it again. Field goal percentage 66% and 34. Offensive shot not putting up on the board. Kemba Walker only got seven points, only three out of ten, and on just three assists right in the game. Lopez, right side to Williams. Six that, six at that time. Williams makes it six points bucket in a row with their offensive execution. You know the defense, Greg, has really been kept off Here's balance smart. because of the outstanding pass. This is five field goals have been made off an assist. Five rolling in. The rebound, a rebound by Matthews. We'll uh, we'll count it again. Here's Lopez. Lopez with the layup. He has his first two bucket of the night and great pass assist by Matthews. From inside the paint. They need a good All defense and tied it up. Blocked by Lopez. And the space Lopez is able to cover on defense using that size and length. Here's Bledsoe outside of the corner. Here's Matthews. Back to Bledsoe. Yeah, over fives. Another miss for Milwaukee, and Bledsoe couldn't handle another shot. Hayward moving it in. Got to hover it. Hover the board, and that works in. Sound like, like a pro. 14 points, 16 minutes on the court, 45 percentage of hard work fragment. And Clark, we see so many foreign players come into the NBA and play well. Not just play, but, but play well. Yeah, and not just Africa. Finds the pass to Lopez. Players from Africa, but a, a number of different countries have, have signed. Lopez with the shot. For a more exciting lead. And yeah, another miss so from, from, the, uh, from beyond the arc. It didn't fall. You know what? That's a Reaching foul on Bledsoe. His first personal foul. And now here are all four subs in and all four sub out. Julia Williams, Green, and Edward comes in. Let's go, Matthews. Middleton comes in. And Hill Corker. Jimmy Ojale comes in for Gordon Hayward. Green is checked in for Smart. And it's Edwards in for Walker. Finds Williams. He passes up to Williams. Edwards coming in to give it a try. Green made that shot, and the first assist goes up with Edwards. Two minutes left in a four period, the final quarter. And have not stopped. Now Brown will come in. Brown to Hill. Hill up to Hill coming in. Yes, that yes, that is Hill another point score with for George Hill. You can't let him feel at ease pulling up from there. You gotta make him uncomfortable. Here's Edwards. He's right on top of him. Edwards with it. Edwards with the ball. And the pass to Williams. And now here's Williams. Going over to Green. 
Jeez, acting like Draymond Green that he was never here before. Wow, I'm surprised. Hill finds Lopez. It was a standout performance. Lopez back to Corfer. A cat play with a mouse. They they were goes to Brown. Whatever. Four to shoot. And in the win loss column tonight. You would shot. Yes. Brown's got two. And the point and, uh, doesn't have any choices but to shoot. All around game for Giannis. Just what? Just under a minute in the final quarter. On defensive trips, he would always buy. He has a shot. Rebounded by Brown. His first rebound there. Brown covered up by 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 Williams. Brown feeling it out a bit. And, it's Corver, and here's Corver right in the corner. Outside Hill. Here's Hill. Hill, Hill no good. Reese Tough deep. The shot clock and game clock. Good and deep by Brown and, and Green misses it. Guys, they can just sit on the ball here if they want to. That they have earned this win. Corver here it goes Hill. back to Hill. And now we are presenting the Jordan player of the game, and this one will go to when, when this game is over, and the game is finally done. 73 to 49 is your final score. Bucks wins the first game in, in the playoff rounds, and they are totally gaining a lot, lot of clear, clear throws, clear shots, and clean passes. And now let's catch up with David Now let's Aldridge. catch up on David Aldridge reporting on the sideline. Dave. Thanks, Kevin. Here with Eric Bledsoe. Eric, a strong performance tonight. What's been the difference? Uh, we're getting out of transition, you know, trying to get people to stop. And everybody's just playing their game. And it shows tonight, Eric. Thanks very much. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David. Thank you, David. Thank you so much, Thank you so much for watching for you guys. And our last uh, first game will be the Rockets facing against the Nuggets in that first game. This one's going to be a very, very exciting game, but I'm sure there will be more underway. So with that, thank you so much for watching. As until next time, peace out, bitches. Well, as a well, as a NBA playoff dial, and then game two will be underway. Thank you and good night.